Okay, um, I'm doing sticks like Gina and Peta, and unfortunately I didn't buy the colored ones, so I am painting them myself. But I am using bright colors. I don't, I just felt like it's Christmas. I'm, Working downstairs tonight, it's about 11 o'clock or so at night. Tomorrow I have a really busy day. <clears throat> I bought these at Walmart. No, I got these at Michael's with a 50% off coupon. <laughs> Can you believe I couldn't find a delusions journal at, Wal at uh, Michael's in Canada? They don't sell them. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. They didn't even know what I was talking about when I asked. I looked high and low on, out through the store. I couldn't find them anywhere. So, yeah, uh, they don't sell them here. So, I ordered one off um, Amazon the big one and uh, I'm getting a small one from Etsy but they're not coming right away they're coming after Christmas so sometime in January mid-January so I'm gonna be behind and I'm um, getting back to these sticks 50% um, off Coupon. I think I spent four dollars and change for 200 pieces of the Createology Jumbo Wood Craft Sticks. So I didn't think that was too bad. I was hoping to use my 50% off coupon on the Dilutions book, but they don't seem to know what it is. Uh, I went to the ranger section thinking, well, maybe, maybe this one's not so great. So I went to the ranger section thinking, well, they're not with the other journals and papers and like art paper and all paints and all that. So I went there and nothing. So yeah, I guess they just don't. They don't sell them. Not here. So, online, expensive for shipping, yikes. <coughs> Although I do do a lot of shopping online, I was hoping to get my journal for 50% off, but that didn't happen. I'm just going to use up this pink. This wood seems to just soak it up. I should have mixed it with a little bit of uh, gesso. So I'll finish these up and I'll be back. Okay, I finished my sticks and I wrote on them all. <laughs> I didn't decorate the tops though and I'm not going to. However, I thought this basket would work but it's just really big on my desk. So I thought I kind of did a makeshift circle here. If I would have had a can it would have been better, but my cans, you know, you have to have that special uh, can opener to um, not have the ends sharp. 
and I don't have that. So I'm just going to use what I have and I, did, I cut chipboard and I kind of made a, a sort of circle and I've used a piece of popsicle stick across the bottom underneath this and uh, I'm hoping that that's, that's going to work. <laughs> Um, I'm not really sure what I'm putting on the bottom yet. Something. It should be fairly sturdy, I think. Hang on a second. Okay, I found a, a piece of painted uh, cardstock that I did. And I think I'm just going to do a circle first, whatever this is. It's not really a complete circle, but <clears throat> I'm going to make it bigger. That could be too big. I want the bottom to be really strong. Well, that'll work, I think. And what I'm going to do is snip these so that they fold up around the bottom. should be snipping some of these off, I think, like angling them. Otherwise, I'm going to have too much paper. seems how it's for me. I guess it's, um, <laughs> it really doesn't matter, you know, if it's a perfect circle or not. It's just holding my inspiration sticks. So, I don't have anything to put them in, so i got to make something. And I wasn't going to spend money to buy something to put them in, so this is how it is. this and I need my glue so sure how this is all going to pan out. <laughs> we'll see. 
if I can get it in the same spot as I had it last time. That would be great. I have a feeling it was there. So far, so good. My hands are going to be full of gel medium. Oh boy. Okay, so what I want to do is put a coat, a really good coat, all over this. Okay, so I think once it cools off, it'll probably still be a little sticky on the bottom. And I'll put some matte varnish or something on that to help that stop that problem. Now, I wanted to use my collage, <laughs> uh, jelly printed, um, whatever's, around it. I think I'll trim it after. So I might put, yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Got my paint shirt on. Oh, one sec. I'm gonna put my paint shirt on. Thank goodness it's a zip up. <laughs> okay. Start about there. tube is almost gone, I'll be glad. Just for the convenience. 
chance of not having it sit around. Trying to roll it as straight as I can. I'm going to cut it off here somewhere. I'm out of frames at times, guys. Yeah, I didn't really get the bottom that right here. Okay. I know. So, this is getting down to the last of it. Thank goodness. I just want to put it on the paper and hopefully it's good. should be able to fold it and hopefully not tear it because it's wet now and it's just print paper. <laughs> Wipe up paper off my desk.
using this anymore. There's a wee bit left in there, but that's okay. I wanted to use my... I keep my matte medium in a <laughs> mustard container. It's really a whole lot easier to pour out. That way you're not fighting with tubes. <laughs> Just going to hit that with a dryer and I'll be right back. Okay, so I wanted to add a little bit more to the inside. Just to make sure that everything has a coat or something on it. <coughs> Uh, you can see the inside has a popsicle stick that's keeping the bottom really strong and that's not going to affect my popsicle sticks at all. So it's pretty dry. But I really liked there's a gray bird there. There's a white one here. I kind of like that white one. But I'm not going to play with it. Let's just see. I want to know if all of my sticks fit in here well. Oh, isn't that nice? Now, this was way too big. So, much better on my desk. So, a real quick, not, not so strong of a can, however, I think what I'm going to do, oh, I've got one right here, I'll just take it off of that. I wanted to put an elastic <clears throat> band around this, which gives it pressure to keep it round. I'll do another one on the bottom because it still needs time to dry. I'll let that dry overnight, but really, <coughs> and I might just leave those elastics on there because it it really holds it together nice, uh, and I like it. <laughs> let me know what you think. You can always put a new plastic uh, elastic on it if it happens to snap off, but it serves my purpose. And that's it for my inspiration sticks. Thanks for watching. Bye.